Okay, so this is the flank primal. In the flank primal, you get the flank steak, which right here, and then you get the bavette or the sirloin flap. This one still has part of the inside skirt on there. It's your first cut. We're gonna cut down and around pretty deep. Let me go on the outside to trace this. And then there's this membrane. We'll pull off the top. And then you'll, we'll cut down to get under this membrane to be able to peel this flank steak out. So this one is just a lot of pulling and then I kind of assist it with my knife coming off. So with this full piece, trimming this up, you can kind of see where the fat lines are. That's gonna guide you of how to trim that. If I keep my knife shallow, I don't want to trim off any, any of the meat, so only the fat to get it ready. So there's the flank steak. So the rest of this is just gonna be trim or garbage if it's too fatty. So the next piece, this inside skirt. You don't wanna to go too deep because right underneath of here is the bavette. So I'm gonna peel off this inside skirt. The bottom half of this inside skirt sits under the short plate, which is this piece right here. So both of these connect this whole piece up into here is the full inside skirt. So this will just come off. There's a membrane on here as well. This is the upper part of the inside skirt. Oh. another membrane that sits on top. So we're pulling these off, we're cutting on the seams and then just taking each seam apart. So you've got fat seams and then the lean seams and then the fat seams. So just going through this primal and take them all off one at a time. Okay, so now the bavette with the sirloin flap sits in here. It's this big oval. I'm not doing a whole lot of cutting. I'm just kind of pulling it off and just tapping it with my knife. Make sure it fully comes off. So here's that full sirloin flap. And again, I'll just go through, trim off some of this extra fat. And lean some of that up. This is really good for carne asada. A good substitute for skirt steak. So the skirt that I pulled off earlier, the flank I pulled off, and now this flap or bavette. I'll do the same thing. Really good for tacos or a bunch of stuff. So there is the sirloin flap. Then there's one last piece of trim on the bottom of this.
I like to turn my knife a little bit sideways so I can just get right up under it and then follow my, my knife right along that fat line to lean this out. All that will go into burger and all of this is just the extra fat that goes into garbage.